William, Prince of Wales, called out of King Constantine's memorial service on Tuesday February 27, for personal reasons, but this has led to a backlash for many. This has led royal expert Nicholas Owen to claim, we will find out the truth at some point. When it comes to the king, my view is that we should be told, Owen added when discussing the head of state's mysterious cancer diagnosis. These insights and more all revolve around the missing components of what the public has been told about King Charles and Kate, Princess of Wales, serious health concerns. We are seeing William step away from royal duties, we are seeing different things happening that we never saw under the Queen, that sort of emotion and those feelings were kept fairly close, she added. Under Elizabeth II's 70.5 year reign, the monarchy operated within the model of kindness but distance, according to one palace insider. The late Queen grew up in a monarchy still rooted in deference, mystery, and Victorian sensibilities. When she came to the throne at the age of 25, it is believed that she was dedicated to maintaining that style of royalty, although she accepted small changes toward modernity after Diana, Princess of Wales, died in 1997. King Charles III's decision to slim down the monarchy is not being met with the wide-ranging approval the monarch may have hoped for. That is the backbone of royalty because that is what makes people in this country feel that the royals are worth having, Lady Colin Campbell dished when discussing all the charity work numerous royal family members contribute to Britain. Anybody who does any charity work in the UK knows most of the work the royals do is behind the scenes, Lady C added. About 98% of it is never reported upon, and it's a big mistake to think that that doesn't count. I think he's guilty of stupidity. The fact of the matter is I have seen for over 20 years that Charles' idea of slimming down the monarchy is unworkable, the aristocrat revealed. Other analysts feel that this level of emotion from only a handful of senior royals, is the key to ensuring the crown's evolution through the 21st century. This has certainly been the most active and engaged, William has been, on events of this scale that we have ever seen, and we can attribute that to his role as heir, according to royal expert Justin Vuk. William really seems to be stepping out and looking to establish his own identity as Prince of Wales in a way that he's never had the opportunity to before, and one that supports causes that are important to him but are also still in line with the overall values of the monarchy at the moment. GBN interviewed Owen.